This is a map of the River Thames. It has a large number of rivers and streams that feed into it. When rain falls in the upper catchment, this water slowly makes its way into the Thames and flows downstream, eventually going out to sea. In this video, we're going to take a closer look at the River Thames between Maidenhead and Old Windsor. When the ground is saturated and rainfall continues, areas along the River Thames flood. What do we mean by saturated ground? Imagine the soil like a sponge. As the rain falls over a period of time, the soil becomes wetter until there is no more space for water to be absorbed. If there's no space in the soil, water will flow over the ground and straight into the rivers. When river levels become high and more rain falls, the rivers become full. At this point, water starts to spill out of the river banks in some places and water moves through the floodplain. As well as flowing over the ground, water can sometimes flow through the soil emerging out of the ground in other places, not always close to rivers. This is called groundwater flooding. The Jubilee Flood Relief Channel was completed in 2002. The Jubilee always has some water flowing through it. It is approximately 11 kilometres long and has a capacity two thirds the size of the River Thames at Maidenhead. When river levels rise, we split some of the water away from the River Thames through the Jubilee. We operate the Jubilee Flood Relief Channel carefully, following our operating procedures. We make frequent and small gate movements, which enables a stable and effective management of flow of water into the channel. Before joining back into the River Thames to continue its journey downstream. By using the Jubilee Flood Relief Channel, we avoid water from the Thames moving through the floodplain in this area. This reduces flood risk to homes and businesses in the Maidenhead, Windsor and Eton area. Communities downstream of the Jubilee do not benefit from the Jubilee, but they are not at increased risk either. So to recap, before the Jubilee was in place, during floods, the Thames swelled, groundwater rose and the water would move across the floodplain. With the Jubilee Flood Relief Channel, the area between Maidenhead and Eton is at reduced risk of flooding. Areas up or downstream of the channel are not impacted positively or negatively. Thank you for watching.